today, I wanted to um, ask perhaps who knows the story of Horatio Spafford? If anybody's ever heard of Horatio Spafford, a few of you have. Um, it's a story, um, late 1800s, when the Chicago fires happened. He was a businessman there, and his business burned down. So he sent his family, he had two daughters and a wife, and he sent them off to Europe. And on their way over there, their ship sank and only his wife survived. When he got the telegram saying that only his wife survived, he was overcome, of course, and, and left right away to go to Europe. Well, as they were passing over the very place where the ship went down, the captain came to him and said, I believe this is where the ship sank. And at those very moments, in his grief, in the middle of his grief, he started penning the words of a hymn that we all know very, very well. And if you open your hymn books to page 493, you can read the words along with what I'm about to play. And it's a challenge that I ask us all to consider for myself, for, for anybody, that we come to a place in our own walk with God that no matter what comes our way, that we can truly say, it is well with my soul. Thank you. 